The Georgia Dome. Engineered by Thornton Thomas Eddy and constructed in 1992, this enormous structure boasted the world's largest and America's first cable-supported fabric roof. In 2017, when it was replaced by a new stadium, it was slated for demolition. But how do you quickly and safely raise a 10-acre building? Since the Georgia Dome was just 84 feet from Mercedes-Benz Stadium and actually touched the Georgia World Congress Center in several places, HHRM asked Thornton Thomas Eddy to conduct a detailed analysis of the demolition plan. To complete the analysis quickly and accurately, we created high-fidelity models of the stadium. We used the roof ring beam model to determine the optimal placement of explosive charges in the beam and the overall stadium model to finalize the demolition sequence, minimizing risk to adjacent structures. After incorporating the demolition plan into the model, we used it to investigate a number of demolition scenarios and complete a series of analysis iterations to optimize and finalize the plan. Thornton Tomasetti's analysis concluded that Pettigrew Incorporated's master plan for demolition of the Georgia Dome was safe and feasible and could proceed, and the stadium was safely demolished on November 20, 2017.